Hey guys, so this video is going to be a hair tutorial, um, natural hair of course. I'm going to be showing you how I got my hair from looking like this to this. If you're interested, just keep on watching. Alright, so I just deep conditioned my hair and rinsed it out. I'm applying um, some leave-in conditioner in my hair. I'm going to do a video after this talking about products that I use in my hair. Anyways, I section off my hair to four parts just to make it easier to detangle. Um, I'm also using a hair milk from Loda Body, which I absolutely love, to help um, detangle as well as just for moisturizing my hair. This is a little bit of a more of a close-up. And um, you can just see that I'm putting it all the way through my hair. And then after I'm following up with this oil, um, I think it's called Chia, Chia Oil. I got it from the Onyx box, which I really, really, really love. If you're not subscribed to that box, box, sorry, box to that box, and you're natural, I definitely recommend that you um, subscribe to them. Anyway, so I'm making sure my hair is really, really moisturized before I apply any heat on it. Right now, I'm just detangling with the pick comb and using a hair dryer. A blow dryer to stretch out my hair for the style that I'm trying to do. Alright, so I made sure the blow dryer was on low heat because I don't want any heat damage. Um, also, after I blow dried it, I braided my hair just to get some definition, like some type of curl definition. Um, also, one trick that I do is if you realize that you grab a pretty big piece and when you get to the end it's a little bit tough for you to braid it or twist it what I always do is when I get to the end and you'll see it in a second I split the end into two and then I either braid or twist those two sections just so I'm making sure that my ends are as defined as I as they can be and this really helps um, to define your ends and making sure that you get the look that you're going for this piece was small enough so I didn't have to split out the ends because um, it was small enough for me to braid it. I know I need to trim my ends. Um, I will be doing that soon. So here I'm just unraveling all my braids. I let it sit for about an hour while I did my makeup and then after I was done with my makeup I just uh, took them out. So now I'm just fluffing it out using a pick to um, stretch it out just a little bit more. And you kind of just want to play around with your hair until you get, you know, the look that you are going for. I did so many different looks with my hair stretched out like this. I did bangs, I did center part, I did side part, all kinds of things. So you can do a mohawk, you can do anything really with your hair stretched out. Also, like I this. find that when you put the heat, some heat with your heat blow dryer to your hair when it's all braided up, when it dries, it's more defined. Hey guys, so if you haven't heard Wanda Cole's album yet, um, I strongly suggest that you uh, go to listen to it because it's the bomb. Anyway, so I'm still messing with my hair. I think this was the style that I decided to finally stick with. And that's just a side part, which was really easy. So, anyways, that's the end of my video. If you have any questions, just put them down below. See you later. Bye.